they magnificent? I don't know how to define how magnificent they are. That unmistakable passion sparked in Barbara Livingston as a young girl growing up near Sarasota Springs and led her to the only career she ever wanted, horse racing photographer. And when you turn your passion into your profession, the results are inevitable. The first time I won an Eclipse Award, which is our Oscars, it took a lot of pressure off because once you've won one, you have one. Not just one, but in fact three Eclipse Awards as Barbara continues to produce some of the best work in the business. But the end result is only half of the story. Thanks to a premature birth, she has vision only from her left eye and only partial vision at that. Literally, like, I don't know if those are men or women right there. Yet she turns this into this. How in the world does that happen? I wonder because I see in two dimensions. I see the way a photograph exists. I don't see a movie. I don't see things moving. I see the way a finished product would be. And I get rid of all the little details in my head. I can't see them. So I see shapes and entire scenes. And I sort of wonder if just seeing the greater scene makes me then hone in on parts of it in a different way somebody else might that's so used to seeing a sign that says stakes barn or a horse going by. I don't see all of that. I just have to pick something and hone in on it. So no self-pity party. Good thing there's no time for that in a business that grows more competitive every day. You know, my greatest challenge nowadays is staying ahead of the competition. And the competition includes every person that gets off the tram with one of these or an iPad and gets in front of me and posts their picture on Facebook in three minutes. My thought process is always create a unique image, a more powerful image than other people and one that's historically relevant because after I'm gone, I'm hoping that someone will shepherd all of my negatives and keep them for the sport. And with that, it's a race of her own to find the next great shot. And part of her motivation to be a success came when Barbara was 15 years old. She broke up with a boyfriend. The boyfriend said, you'll never be anything. You're not going to amount to anything. She said, oh yeah, I'm going to be famous. Barbara, she was right. At Old Pimlico, Pete Gilbert, WBAL, TV 11 Sports.